Hello, dear friends, subscribers, and students of our channel in YouTube, sayitcorrectly.org. As I said last week, we are going to begin a new series with nouns. This time, we're going to have the items at home, home sweet home. We are going to begin with the main entrance or the front entrance where we have the following items. We have the main door, we have the doormat, we have the doorbell, we have the door lock, the doorknob, and the peephole. Next, we are going to see the items inside the uh, living room. Some people call it the sitting room also. Now, inside the living room, we have curtains, of course. We have paintings or pictures. We have a sofa with pillows. No, no pillows, cushions. And we also have carpet or carpets. We also have a chimney. Some people have the chimney on the second floor to keep themselves warm in the winter time. Next, we'll see the dining room. Inside the dining room, of course, we have tables and chairs. We have silverware, sometimes on the table. We also have a china closet somewhere around here china closet then we have the tablecloth and we have the napkins and we also have pictures and glasses on this side over here we have the garden sometimes there is a tree sometimes there are bushes sometimes even a swimming pool or a swing for the kids we have also, we might have a bird feeder and we have plants and flowers. Next, we have the bathroom. In the, inside the bathroom, we have towels. We have a shower. We have a toilet and we have a wash basin. We also have um, a bathtub bathtub and we also have the medicine cabinet see the medicine cabinet we have a mirror and that's it the attic is this place right here where people keep old things for example an old trunk full of very old stuff and sometimes the suitcases when they travel are kept in the attic Next, we are going to see bedrooms. In this case, it will be the children's bedroom. Sometimes we have the master bedroom and the children's bedroom. Inside the children's bedroom, we have a bunk bed. Beds, of course, belong inside a bedroom. Then we have a closet for you to hang your clothes or the children's clothes. We have a night table. In, on top of the night table, we have a night lamp or an alarm clock. We also have um, a dresser. And that's all we have inside the bedroom. Remember, sometimes the second, the master's bedroom is on the second floor. Next, we'll see the garage. In the garage, what is it that you keep in the garage? vehicles that is automobiles motorcycles or bicycles in the garage we also have the garden hose to water the garden and to water the plants we have a toolbox inside there is a toolbox right here or a board with tools we also have a workbench for a man to work he needs a workbench the garage opener, it's always electric, it's on top. The garage opener and the garage door. And um, shelves, very important. Shelf, a shelf, and sometimes shelves. Remember to replace the F for V and to add ES, shelves. Okay, next we'll see what's inside the kitchen. 
Inside the kitchen we have a fridge, a refrigerator. We have a microwave. Microwave is very important. A blender is an instrument that you cannot leave out in the kitchen. The coffee maker for the mornings. A toaster oven is the best oven you can find. Toasts and bakes. A sink, very important to wash the dishes, the sink. And the stove, of course, you need a stove. Next, we're gonna see the study room or the office. Some people have an office in their house, in their homes. In this particular one, you have a laptop or you have a desktop. It's equipment that you cannot leave out from an office room. We also have um, sometimes a fan, ceiling fan. Sometimes we have an AC unit, air conditioning unit. You also have a desk organizer on top of your desk, a little thing where you organize your paper clips, erasers, pens and markers. Then you need a file cabinet. You need a file cabinet and you need a waste basket. The laundry room. We are going to replace the office or the study room for the laundry room. We have a picture here where we have the washing machine, we have the dryer, we have the iron and the ironing board. We also have um, hangers for the clothes. We have a laundry basket and we have dirty laundry. Last, we have the, the stairs. The stairs you needed to go upstairs or downstairs. Well, we hope you like this video because it has, it introduces several nouns within their places. We apologize that we only loaded up one video last week. Some people make comments that we are down on the amount of videos that we are loading up. We had technical difficulties and we'll see you very soon with the second video on nouns, which is going to be people. Okay. Thank you so much. Give us a like on the video. Visit our page if you want to. Follow us on in Instagram and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.